The neighborhood in Shaler, where police shot and killed a man yesterday, is still reeling. Don Babbitt taught math at Penn Hills High School. Police say he barricaded himself inside a home, then charged at officers. Brenda Waters spent the day talking to neighbors. Brenda. Hi, Christine. Allegheny County police are investigating what transpired yesterday in Shaler about 3.30 yesterday afternoon. But as of right now, there is no new update. Meantime, this is what was going on in the neighborhood today. And those who knew Don Babbitt had nothing but good things to say about him. I thought it was surreal. Um, he's a very nice person. I, I very wonderful family. I never... I, I was just shocked. But something went terribly wrong Tuesday afternoon inside Don Babbitt's house on Spencer Grove Lane in Shaler. I saw Don coming out of his garage. I didn't see what he had in his hand because a tree branch was in the way. But the, the police ordered him to stop, hands up, and they did it several, several, a lot of times. And he just kept going, and then he was shot numerous times and dropped to the ground. Patty Toronto lives two doors down the street from the family. She told me the Penn Hills math teacher was always so prim and proper. 17-year-old Kaylee Plavetsky says she was friends with one of the Babbitt's two children. But what she saw yesterday really frightened her. I was laying out in my pool and I heard screaming. So I looked up and I saw my, na my neighbor. He was naked in his backyard. And it, it's like not normal to me, so I called my mom. Plavetsky said before she saw Babbitt, she heard loud noises coming from inside his house. He walked down through here, and then we had a thing that filters out the pool in here, and he took that off and put it on his head, and then he walked back down. I was under there on the phone with my mom. I was freaking out because he's a nice guy. So the big question tonight is what went wrong with this really nice guy? Reporting live in Green Tree at County Police Headquarters, Brenda Waters, KDKA News. Yeah.